Hi friends, it's Nancy back with another video. I know I said the next video will be in the corn maze, but um, I got some corn behind me. It's not the corn maze. It is uh, 640, 20 of 7 in the morning here in New Jersey, and I still can't see to go pick. But I'm going to attempt to do so. If I have to use the front of the truck lights, I will do that because I need to get ready for a market for today. And good morning from the rooster. We're at a time of the year where we're busy because we have groups coming for wagon rides and pumpkin picking. So let's go outside, show you what's going on. Stand is not open, so there's nothing in here. And um, I'm going to get ready for my day. It's a little chilly, as you can tell, I'm wearing a hoodie. Does that make people want to pick pumpkins? I don't think so. Um, they'll be out here in their flip-flops and shorts if they come, tank tops, because it's going to be toasty. But um, I hope they look the calendar and realize, oh yeah, we're running out of time, let's go pick a pumpkin. Because last weekend we had the rain day and we lost our Monday. And Saturday was breezy and cold, so you know we're kind of dependent on the weather, as always. But um, it's also our fall festival, so people will hopefully come out for that and it will be a good time. All right, I think I better go feed the rooster too, so um, he'll stop his cock and doodle doing. So this is what we got just before 7 in the morning. And trust me, the camera adds a little more light than um, what I actually can see. So I think I can cut some eggplant and, uh, I don't know, maybe I'll be able to see the peppers soon. There's the peppers. Let's see what I could do. So again, when you go to a farm market this time of year, you cannot say, was all those picked fresh this morning? Because um, it's hard. All right, I'm going to see what I can do. I need one of them lights for my hand this time of year. It's a little crazy. I'm going to put these in the truck and uh, see what I can pick. And here's our eggplant. And um, here's our beautiful flowers. And here is the entrance to the mini maze. And maybe you're saying, what's all that stuff? Looks a mess. You know what that stuff is? That is stuff that we didn't get to. And we did not have it laying here while we were open because we're not nitwits. Um, I really thought I would have got it done this week, but I didn't. So I'm going to pick that up and put it in the back of the truck for another day when I can finally get that done. Because this is a mini maze for children younger children um in the schools when they come they walk through this maze because you're not getting terribly lost it's um unless you go that way then you're like off into the big maze but i will probably put something here to block it um i have a decorative thing that i'll put there and um you know there's like little squares in here and stuff that they really won't get that bad lost because a couple groups already earlier in the week and last week terribly lost and they have buses to catch, and I don't walk in there with them, but then I have to go get them, and it's kind of tough. But I want to address something, and this is, it's still early in the morning, and I want to talk to you about, and mention that this is a farming family. Like, Anita and I run the farm with our families, and we do farming videos, so if that's not the thing for you, like, I would never say, never want to say, just, well, then don't watch and be rude, but in a way... It's the truth. I mean, the people that watch us, we're at a small farm in New Jersey, and we knew that a thousand views, like, that's what we would get. 500 views, that's awesome. We interact with thousands of people a week, and if those people watch, that's how many views we would expect. So, we're happy with that amount of people. And um, it, right now, I'm thinking of this sign that Anita made that says, Don't be an ass, because, like, why the rude comments? And like, I'm in a corn maze, and yeah, you can get lost in here, and I'm feeling lost. Friends, I'm back in the road stand, um, in the corn maze, my batteries died, you know? It's knocked me in the head. Things happen. That's real life. Things get crazy. Um, I'm not a professional YouTuber. Anita's not a professional YouTuber. We are just sharing things that we do at the farm, and again, if this is not the channel for you, and with anything in life, don't do something you don't want to do. So... I am not begging for money. That is a picture of me kissing my duck. I wasn't kissing my duck because I'm not a weirdo. I was pretending. But the person's asking for money, and I hope that you would know, once you hit that link, it's not me. It's a, like a whole different lady. I don't even know what that's about. 
I'm, I'm not crazy like that. If I had a financial issue, I would get a job, get a second job, a third job, work my butt off, and my husband would do the same, and the family would do the same to help each other out. Because that's what it's all about. It's family. It's running a family farm. And if you know nothing about farming, you know nothing about a family farm, this is what people do. It's our passion. It's what my grandfather did. It's what my uncles and aunts and my father did. So we're going to keep running the farm. And yes, Anita shared that she did get another job, but she's here at the farm. Sometimes health insurance and dental insurance is very important. Um, and she's going to get that with her new job. So I'm going to take you to Roxburgh today. And this is the craziness that you don't see because we, do, we don't have a camera person and um, this is what we do here. I am moving this van that was right by the back of the stand because we took it to the market yesterday and I have to get in another vehicle. So this van is going to sit here because I need to have access to assuming my license so that's a little crazy that I cart that around all the time. I need um I should say I have my license in a luggage thing that luggage tag holder because Troy bought that for me because Anita and I were throwing you know most women carry pocketbooks can't do that we um we were throwing our license in our back pocket and it really took a beating so all right I don't have the keys they're in there because all the keys are now in the right vehicles because it's morning and uh, I'm gonna get in this van but, all right, so I got these keys. I'm in this van. And I drive this next door. Well, friends, I am leaving. I'm in another vehicle off to the market in Philly. That is a bus. We had a school here today, and um, they're still here. We're getting all wrapped up and ready to go. I'm going to Roxbar in Philadelphia. So I'm going to take you with me so you can see the park and all. It's pretty cool there. All right, friends, we'll see you at the park. Friends, here we are in Roxburgh in the park. I'll have to walk you around and show you a little bit before it gets dark. Kelly works here with us, and it's going to get dark soon, Kelly, isn't it? Yes. yes. It is. Um, market usually goes till 7, but now we tell people we will be done before 7 because it's dark. Like right before 7, we'll start cleaning up. So this is what we have, what's in season. Um... Uh, look, look at that friends a little bit of eggplant member picked that earlier this morning it's apple season got some pumpkins I got well we always have our honey but we got one pumpkin two pie pumpkins left and some spookies and here is our neighbor in Roxburgh let's show him oh, this is Jay chef Jay Howard Jay's gourmet is fine foods and baked goods Listen, I'm the guy that makes all this, right? I'm the guy that makes all this, including this guy right over here. Ooh. Now, I'm holding a piece of this. This is a buffalo blue cheese bread. The dough is made with hot sauce, crumbled blue cheese, celery seed, and red pepper flakes. Woo! It's, we shaved it like footballs this week. It's crazy, Look at right? It's awesome. It's so good. That's All right, now, Jay, we also have to show them your attire here. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Look. Look I at... I did a little mix and match today. This is my fall ensemble, okay? I got a little bit of Halloween going on because people this. know that look. I have bats in my belfry, all right? Look at bats, bats. And then I have then we some go down. Little, look, a little fall harvest action Whoa. going on, all right? Down to and the I don't legs. usually lift my apron for any, everybody, you know what I mean? Only the YouTube that's friends. Right. That's right, only for our YouTube friends. No, wait, let's talk about these shoes. Let's talk about the shoes, all right? These are some neon Crocs that they I have are. on today. Some neon Crocs. And they match the yellow. They match the oh, leaves. That's man. right. I'm, all, I'm hooked up. You, you know put what I mean? yourself together out That's here. That's right. I'm, I'm hooked up, you know? And the best part about it is the pants are elastic waist. So I can eat anything or as much as I want. <laughs> I love elastic. You gotta yeah. love elastic. Yeah, gotta love You elastic. gotta love yeah, Jay's right. stuff here. Oh, good stuff. Here we so go. this is yes, the neighbor. My bounty, my harvest. Mm. My little children. It's what's all in about season. to leave the nest. Oh, beautiful. Hey, how are you? Hey, 
Thank you, Jay. You're welcome. I'm going to show them some of the park. <laughs> You'll have to uh, let me know the YouTube. That stuff is gorgeous. All right, friends, here we are in the park. We just talked to Jay. And then, come walking through is this lady with this awesome camera. Show them how this camera works. This is what we need. This is a GH5 Panasonic. It's like they had it new past year. And this is the Ronin, GJI Ronin M. It's a gimbal for movement. We use it to have, if we have like a moving shot, we yeah. use it to follow the actor or the actor. Cool. It's kind of reasonable weight and price for it. Oh. What the things it does. Yeah. So it's good. Yeah, hold them up and show them how we... Uh, and now my camera's dead. Oh, her camera is dead. But any any way that she moves it, it just... Yeah, it's like when you, look at, you have different It just options. flips around. Uh, you can flip it this way. Wow. Look at that. See, it's going on here. You have like this oh, wow. is easier. Look at this. Holy moly. Uh, we have different... This, they call it... This is the briefcase. It's called briefcase if you have like, ah. tight space. Oh! Is there honey for this guy? Uh, there might be one more in. Yeah, I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> yeah. Wow, so cool. So thanks for showing us your camera. You and good luck to you. Thanks. Alright friends, I'll show you a little bit of the park. That's where we work. We do the market. <clears throat> Here's some of the landscaping they have here at the park. So this is right on, we are right off a ridge. So that is a ridge right there. And in fact, there'll be a ridge tomorrow at East Falls, but way up the road. Is the back of the park. It's huge. Like I could never walk all the way down there. And apparently they have a dog park over here. So this is Roxburgh. All the dogs down there running. Then we have a gazebo. And they do concerts and stuff in the park. So I guess that's what they use that for. And then they have a monument here. And there's a play area. This park is actually really huge. So I'm going to get back to the market. We'll be packing it up and we'll be leaving. We're done here at 7. So I know when we started, friends, it was 6 something in the morning. So this is what they do. Concerts and movies in the park. Alright, so we will pack this up soon and head home. watching friends hit a like and um this weekend we got a lot of fun stuff coming up so hope to see you this weekend